Doctors here in Utah say teenagers can't tell the difference between legal and black market vaping cartridges. That's especially concerning given the hundreds of cases of vaping related illness seen all across the country. So far, there have been six deaths from lung disease, possibly tied to vaping, and now 36 states, including Utah, are reporting seeing similar illnesses. That comes to a total of 380 confirmed cases, according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. Doctors at the University of Utah Hospital now say they have also seen a recent spike in lung disease related to vaping in young people. The hospital has confirmed at least 13 cases. ABC4's Jared Jotanini spoke with doctors. Doctors here who specialize in lungs and breathing say in recent months they seen an increased number of young people coming here with lung disease, possibly relating to vaping. They're asking folks to stop vaping. I think it's fair to yeah. ca call it early phases of an epidemic. Yeah. I mean, this is... Uh, something that has really spiked since this summer. Doctors at the University of Utah Hospital say the number of lung disease cases are up. The majority of our patients are young, previously healthy people who are coming in with shortness of breath, um, generally signs of lots of whole body inflammation. Doctors say the commonality between the patients, vaping. Inflammation in the lungs as well as immune cells containing oil or lipid material. Although doctors say these lung disease cases are likely caused in part by vaping, the CDC will determine an official cause. With the information we have right now, um, we can say that there is no single specific product, ingredient, vaping device that's been tied to all cases. In Salt Lake City, Jared Jatinini, ABC4 News. Here in Utah, the health department has confirmed at least 35 vaping-related cases and no deaths.